Hi, how's it going? I'm in my room doing this video with uh, pretty low light because it's dark out and this light is like one of the energy saving ones so it kind of looks poopy when I don't have any sunlight coming in so you have to forgive that but over time, over the past couple months I've been getting random comments of, you know, Seamus needs a haircut. He looks, you know, way better, short hair and that always seems to be the instance of these things. It's always, you know, Seamus is too skinny, he's too fat Hair is too long, hair is too short, too pale, too whatever. This goes with, you know, everyone. This is something that people always run into their entire lives. Someone always thinks that they need to do something to please them, which I don't really understand that. But, uh, my hair has been long, and these comments started to pop up maybe a couple months ago. And uh, that was right around the time where I was considering getting a haircut. However, as many of you know, I often do the opposite of what people tell me to do, if I think it is a poor complaint or a poor suggestion, and if it keeps happening, like it has been, I usually do the complete opposite, but I haven't said anything. So, as you can tell, my hair is a little bit longer, a little bit shaggier. It gets pretty curly when it, uh, when it gets longer, and I, I just got out of the shower, so it's a little wet, as you can possibly tell. It's not as poofy. It usually gets poofy when it, uh, when it gets dry. So, either way, I thought of doing something stupid for really no reason to prove a point to say you know show show a moral type thing what I, or just be you know dumb which is what I usually do so what I have here I have one of these which doesn't really do anything but and then I have the second one but I want to show that to some people who think you know someone has to act a certain way someone has to look a certain way it's not always the case you should just accept people for who they are or what they look like and I'm not afraid of looking you know as stupid as I have to be, I do pretty stupid shit on a general basis. So, I have this whole glob here. I just put all this shit in my hair because I really don't care exactly, you know, what I look like or what my personal appearance is. So, there you go. There's that. Uh, but yeah, I've got two jars of these to use. But what I really wanted to say was that you really shouldn't judge people for how odd they might look sometimes because. I don't know, it's just something we sh we shouldn't do. Some people can pull off a mohawk. I really can't. I don't think I've ever tried, but there you go. I also have like a pretty glaring birthmark. Uh that a lot of that white stuff isn't just uh axe jizz. It is a birthmark, which is basically just not so much a birthmark as it is um my hair doesn't have any pigmentation at that point, so it kind of grows in white. But uh yeah, there you have it, you know. I would just like if people could be nice for once and love me for who I am, but that seems to be pretty impossible. So I don't care how stupid I have to look to uh, to prove to the masses that I really don't give a shit. And you shouldn't either. I'm sure a lot of you are in high school and uh, having some of the same problems as I did when I was in high school. A lot of people get made fun of and stuff for, you know, I used to have shaggy hair in high school too, and people didn't like it back then, I'll tell you that much. And it's a lot harder to escape that when you have a building full of people that you have to walk to and interact with on a daily basis, but, uh, you know, look at all this, look at all this slop, look at all this slop, all over my face, I don't care, I was hoping it would show up a little bit better on my face, but, you know, being as pasty as me, I don't know who's paler, Seamus the wrestler, or Seamus the YouTube idiot, I'm not sure, but, you know, the point of this was to basically just say, be who you are, do what you want to do, don't listen to what other people say, as long as you're not hurting anyone, who the fuck really cares? I don't. I went through that for four years in high school, and I had to be with that every day, and it sucked. So, for those of you who have watched this and enjoyed it, thank you. I've got a little bit more axe to use. I don't want this flopping all over the place, but, you know, there you go. I have so much of this shit in my hair, CM Punk would be just fucking shocked. So, there you have it. Thank you for watching and heed my message.